Neverland has never been closer. The Children's Theater of Cincinnati is heading into its final weekend of performances. Our very own Bob Herzog has been splitting his time from here <laughs> to there to play the infamous Captain Hook. Arg! And Bob's at the Taft Theater right now as the crew gets ready. Morning, Bob. Hi, oh, Bob. Oh, you, oh, you're all oh, dressed he's up. He's all dressed up. Looking good. Hast thou ever dreamed of being pirates, me hearties? Oh, I know you have. Hey, everybody! <laughs> I am, I am, I'm aboard the Jolly Roger, guys. You are, you are witnessing me on top of my pirate ship right now. We're pushed all the way back of the stage, though, here at the Taft Theater because there's a whole lot of stuff going on. The guys from IOTC Local Five, the crew here, they got a lot of stuff to move. And uh, right now, my pirate ship is in the back of the room. But check out the nursery scene. That's where we start things out when Peter Pan Jr. gets started. In just a few minutes, they'll be bringing in. I don't know hundreds of kids for field trips and that kind of thing. But they're not really waiting to see the, the nursery set up. They're not really even really waiting to see the hook. They're waiting to see this guy. This is Kelsey Steele. He is Peter Pan and Peter Pan Jr. How you feeling, buddy? I feel great. You know, ready to get this morning started with some good shows. And it's and it's a lot of fun when that many kids come in there. Because the first time you take off, you can can you hear the gasp? Because I'm off to the side of the stage. I can hear the gasp. Oh yeah, there's nothing like it. You know, it's, for a lot of these kids, it's their first time seeing a show or seeing live theater. So to do something magical like flying is great. Yeah, it, it, it's it's cool to watch. Do we have that bag? Jen Picone, our stage manager over here, has this. See, this, this is the good stuff, guys. All right, this is the stuff, kids. You be careful. This is the, uh, this is the fairy dust. But it turns out it takes more than just fairy dust and happy thoughts to get this guy in the air. I mentioned the union guys from IOTC Local 5. We've got Luke and Chevy back here. They actually have a great deal to do with it beyond just the, the fairy dust and the happy thoughts. You, can we fly you a little bit? Yeah, let's go for it. All right, let's see what this, let's see what this looks like. There he goes. <laughs> now see, he looks, he looks all graceful. And one of the reasons he got a lot of help and training flying by Foy, that's the team that came in and, and got the rig all set up and got him prepared to go back and forth through the air with the uh, greatest of ease. I mean, he lands on the mantle guys above the fireplace. He shoots out the window. They have the rigging somehow set up so he actually spins around at one point too which is pretty fantastic so uh it's a lot of fun we're letting you in on the magic we have the field trip shows today we've got a public performance tonight oh my see that just that terrifies me my goodness we've got a public performance tonight we've got two tomorrow and one on sunday guys can i get back him back over here i'm gonna ask him one more question real quick is, is he heavy chevy no not at all he's not <laughs> plus i just wanted to say heavy chevy because that was fun for me all right so after the show, are you, are you, now I know this answer already because you and I are in the same dressing room. Are you horribly uncomfortable by the time you're finished or not too bad? Um, you know, it's not as uncomfortable as you would think it is. Um, <laughs> but yeah, there's, there, there's some, uh, you know, there's some pain. You know, I got some bruises on my arms from these wires doing some, some funny things. But, you know, it's, it's all in the fun and all for theater. So. And all worth it. Okay, so a few performances left. We've got information on our website, local12.com, all that kind of good stuff. But guys... I'm having a good time, in case you hadn't. Do you guys oh. like the hair, by the way? Do you guys think I could make this work on an everyday basis? You look like Rick James. Rick James. <laughs> <laughs> but here, I want to know if Rick Flying James. by Foy will hey. come here to our studio and teach us how to fly. I don't, I don't know. But, hey, John Lomax, you know what I'm really doing here? I'm letting my soul glow. Just let your soul glow, <laughs> baby. <laughs> that doesn't work with the pirate Some hat, more. though. you got to take the pirate hat off. <laughs> Thank you, Bob. That was fun. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, public show from Peter Pan Jr. will run through Sunday. I can see him pulling the wires, and it still looked to me like he was flying. It was cool. It was very yeah. cool.